What up, what up, what up? This is Star with Stars and First Wisdom. What's good, Gemini Twin Gang, my loves? How y'all doing? Hopefully you guys are doing lovely. If you are new to the channel, welcome. If you are returning, welcome back. This is going to be a reading for Gemini Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, as well as North Node. This could be involving a soulmate, a twin flame, someone from your soul tribe, family member, friend, anyone or anything involving love or in general in the next seven days for the sign of Gemini. All right, energies can be vice versa. So getting where y'all fit in, you know who you are in the story if you're keeping it 100. Uh, but then again, messages may or may not resonate. You know what I'm saying? If they do, y'all know what to do. All right, um, if you would like to highlight me, that information will be in the description box below. But let's go ahead and get started though. All right, so for my Geminis for the next seven days, um, I'm definitely getting that. Uh, I got pre-channel messages for you guys. I'm definitely getting that uh, your your guides or your um angels or um your ancestors are definitely trying to reach out to you at this time um about being decisive about making a clear decision all right so making a decision a choice uh the choice is yours all right but uh for my pre-channel messages that i was saying you may feel an investment or work situation slipped away from you all right so this could be like i said a work situation or um a relationship um, that may have been like an investment. Someone needs to focus less on sex, okay, or a one night stand and more on work. All right. And I'm getting like uh, independently. So I feel like um, someone here could be way more focused on sexual, uh, you know, their sexuality or having sex with people or hooking up with people, having one night stands, partying, blase, blase. All right. Um, I feel like someone may need to uh, focus less on uh, getting a getting a good good in and more on work at this time. All right. Um, also, a new opportunity could come about in the next two weeks here. All right. Some of you guys could be watching church service, like a church service on TV, because you guys could be working a lot. So you could be, um, you know, and also because of the Corona situa situation, some of y'all could be uh, not going to a church. So you could be watching it online or watching it on TV. All right. Um, this could also be a Leo that's watching some type of uh, church service on TV. This could be someone who is religious. All right. Um, this person may be feeling a loss at this time. So they could be feeling a loss regarding you. All right. Or you could be feeling this loss. OK, um, definitely getting mad tears. So somebody real see it. OK, I feel like somebody could be like balling. Somebody could be really upset, but I'm, I'm getting they balling because they not balling <laughs> or they balling because they feel like somebody else that walked away is balling. All right. So I feel like somebody crying. They tears is fake. Yeah. Somebody's not communicating here. All right. So somebody crying because they're upset that they lost some type of investment here. Um, also, someone's desires with the soldier now has them declined. All right. So somebody could have had a one night stand with a soldier or something like that. Or this could be some type of uh, alliance with a soldier that has somebody uh, getting rejected at this time. All right. In the next seven days. Um, also, someone may be afraid of the virus and take a. Uh, you know, be afraid of like the, you know, the Corona situation going on right now or just afraid to go to the doctors or afraid of Western medicine. Um, don't be afraid. OK, I feel like y'all don't need to be afraid. You guys are intelligent enough to, um, you know, to be able to make the right decisions here. This could have to do with you being a mother. So you may have to uh, make a, you know, maybe you got to do some research here. I'm, I'm getting that you definitely are intelligent. Um enough to be able to take action with whatever this is because this, this could have to do with like the doctors or something like that um so you know don't be scared uh, i'm definitely getting that you guys uh y'all smart enough to be able to know know if it's some fuckery or not okay uh dealing with something regarding western medicine also um something regarding the vaccine for the virus may be moving forward okay so, yeah, I feel like uh, some of you guys that could have to do with like worldwide news or something like that. You could be seeing that. All right. But anyways, so let's go ahead and get into the reading. So let's go ahead and get into recent past energy for my Gemini's. Those messages may or may not have resonated. Take what do later the rest. OK. All right. Be kind, Gemini. All right. Some of you guys, I feel like you guys, um, you guys could, oh, this could be somebody that is defensive towards you, somebody who's very nurturing, somebody who's very love, uh, loving, all right? Or you could be very defensive towards a, a mother, okay? Or towards someone who is very, um, you could have been this nurturing person here. But let's see. I feel like somebody feel like somebody being fake. 
All right, let's see. In the recent past, for Gemini. All right, so I feel like um, somebody could have been using spell work for a while. All right, somebody could have been using spell work to hold on to a situation or a person. All right, this could have been a Leo or a Virgo, an Aries or a Taurus. All right, so that could be uh, your placements or this person, but I'm definitely getting that somebody was using spell work here in the recent past to uh, hold on to a situation. I'm hearing somebody who was batshit crazy. All right, um, I'm hearing Kanye crazy, Kanye crazy. Uh, ooh, that little dark, um, yeah, that Kanye crazy. So, uh, that Gemini, <laughs> is that you, love? Is that you? Okay. So I'm definitely getting love spells, all right, come to me spells. I'm definitely getting that somebody was using this for a long, long time to hold on to somebody, okay, to try to keep somebody stuck uh, with them or something like that. Yeah, I feel like, uh, but somebody may have left. Somebody may have left their family or left home or left a family despite this. All right, let's see. All right, so you could be dealing with a Piscean or an Aquarius, or this happened in Piscean or Aquarius season. I'm getting last year. This could be this year, um, but I'm getting that this could have been last year in Piscean season or Aquarius season um, from uh, February to April of last year. I feel like you guys could have been definitely, um, somebody could have been doing spell work on you guys to hold on to a situation, or you could have been doing spell work on someone else to try to hold on to a situation. Um, but I feel like someone here could have went towards a new love. All right. And I feel like this person may have uh, been cold towards you or you could have, you know, went towards a new love and uh, became cold towards this person. Uh, I'm definitely getting that somebody could have been in tears here or been upset. All right. Let's see about this situation. But I feel like something could have ended. Um, something could have started. Like, I feel like somebody was doing spell work and it could have got found out last February. And I feel like it started to dwindle or die down um, or somebody found out by uh I'm getting Aries, so maybe Aries Taurus season. All right, yeah, I feel like then somebody became protective. So I feel like somebody became protective. Somebody started to, like, uh, you know, act like a snail, okay? Somebody was, move, you know, moving fast or moving towards somebody or doing something fast. Or, you know, I feel like I'm getting somebody who juggles a lot, okay, um, or does a lot for somebody here. And I feel like this person became protective of themselves, and this person started to, like, slowly, like, be like, wait a minute. Hold on, let me let me take sl uh, slug steps or let me let me take snail uh, snail steps forward with you because I don't know, you know. So I feel like somebody started to become more cautious, become aware that this was going on. Um, I'm also getting that this is a mother here, somebody who um, is a good nurturer. If it's not a mother, I feel like somebody became protective, even this is a, even if this is a male energy. So a male energy could have been uh, very protective over their relationship or very nurturing towards their uh, new relationships. So someone could have definitely. Um, you know, started to halt from a, another situation here. All right. I feel like, yeah, somebody slowed down. Something slowed down here. Um, and this could be somebody or something slowed down here with you because somebody went towards a mother or went towards uh, somebody who they feel is the queen of pentacles, someone who's nurturing. Yeah, I feel like somebody may have released somebody who uh, works for the medical field, doctor, uh, nurse, something like that. Yeah, for somebody who's carefree. So I feel like somebody wanted to protect their uh, new relationship. All right, somebody may have realized that they were under spell work or that somebody was trying to do come to me spells in the recent past here. Yeah, that's why somebody's not communicating. Somebody's getting declined. That's what was in the pre-channel messages as well. All right, let's go ahead and see current energy. And it may not be necessarily uh, come to me spells. I'm definitely getting that specifically, but it could also be like, um, you know, people just trying to find a way to break you and your new person up. All right. Or you could have been trying to find a way to break uh, somebody up with their new person or whatever, because you could have wanted to hold on to this person or something. And then they was like, eh, OK, well, I'm going to stop moving towards you because uh, that's not what I'm looking for. All right. Um, or vice versa. But let's see. Current energy for Gemini. All right, so I feel like um, somebody here could be, uh, I feel like there could be a pregnancy here or there could be some type of, I'm also getting um, ovarian cysts or some type of medicine regarding reproductive reproductive system here. All right, so um, you could be having issues here with your reproductive system, your ovaries. All right, um, if you're a female, um, 
So some of you guys could be taking medicine for that at this time. Um, others of you guys, I'm getting that someone here, they got pregnant because uh, they needed some type of... Uh, I feel like somebody was being used as like a medicine or used as a cure. You know, I feel like somebody could have been um, trying to use a pregnancy to drain someone here. All right. Or to hold on to somebody here because somebody uh, helps some. I feel like somebody exalts someone when they're in a relationship with them. Like they build their confidence. They build their self-esteem. They boost them up. They, you know, this, uh, the person ends up getting uh, opportunities and things like that. So I'm getting like an energy vampire, somebody who uh, could have definitely here used a pregnancy to um, to do this here. All right. Or somebody could have tried to get you pregnant to do this. You could be realizing this. That somebody was uh, could have got you pregnant to um, try to absorb your luck, okay? Or this this could be you love. You could have did this to someone else. All right, yeah, I feel like somebody's finding out the secrets, okay? This could have been from the last two to three years or five years. All right, so five for five years, someone could have been hiding a secret about a fertility, about a pregnancy. All right, yeah, somebody because somebody got their wish fulfillment. So I feel like somebody got wish fulfillment from a pregnancy situation. Um... And so I feel like this person is still not trying to, uh, you know, let this secret out. I feel like somebody is trying to still hold on to this secret. Yeah, somebody drinking. All right. I feel like somebody drinking, watching to see like, damn, is, is they going to tell my secrets or do they know my secrets yet? Um, but I feel like, yeah, somebody uh, somebody definitely may know here, um, but somebody could be focused on a new love. All right. Yeah. Somebody could be partying with their new love or their true love. Um, this could be a husband. All right. But I'm definitely getting here that there was some type of secret surrounding a, a fertility. Yeah, it could be. Um, I'm getting some of you guys could also be going to the doctors. Like I said, if you uh, if this is like a reproductive system issue, like with your ovaries or um, something like that, I feel like some of you guys uh, don't be afraid of going to the doctors here. I feel like things will work out. Yeah, victory and success. I feel like you guys will have victory and success here um, if you go. All right. Um, but I'm definitely getting you have good look, good health. I feel like things have changed. All right. So if you were experiencing bad health or if you feeling worried about going to the doctors because you like, oh, no, they finna tell me. I feel like uh, victory and success is here for you. All right. Um, some of you guys may just need some type of medicine or something like that. All right. But I'm not really getting that as much as I'm getting um, that it's whatever. I feel like something is negative here. I feel like um or you have healed from something here for some of you guys. Others of you guys, I'm getting that uh, somebody could have found out here that there was some secrets surrounding a pregnancy, okay? And I feel like the person who has the secrets is uh, drunk watching, all right? Yeah, because I feel like this person wants you to be generous again, all right? Or maybe you want this person to be generous towards you again, but I feel like this there is angel, uh, there's angels here, there's cherubim here protecting somebody, all right? Yeah, protecting a star, because I feel like somebody is a star, but they could have been overly uh, generous to people and uh, situations. Someone could have lacked self-esteem. All right. But yeah, I feel like in the near future, someone's ships are about to come in. Yeah. And I feel like that's going to be uh, via social media or something like that. YouTube, IG, Twitter. All right. Let's see in the next seven days. In the next seven days for Gemini. So I feel like uh, there's going to be a rebirth of a situation here juggling to love us. OK, so I feel like somebody here uh, is trying to rebirth the situation here, but they still trying to juggle. Um, somebody's having sexual thoughts. This go along with the pre-channel message. Somebody needs to stop thinking about sex. OK, sex and him, her, whoever. OK, I feel like somebody is trying to rebirth the situation just so they can continue to juggle. All right. Or you want to hold on to or rebirth the situation just to continue to juggle somebody. All right, could just because somebody wants to have sex. All right, somebody could be definitely plotting on having a new beginning here with you, or you could be plotting on having a new beginning here with somebody else just for some sex. Okay, or for some for some dumb or something in the world. All right, so let's that's too many. Yeah, but I feel like somebody is already somebody has already mourned the loss of the situation. All right, let's see. Yeah, I feel like you you may end up feeling conflicted if you go back towards the situation because I feel like um, you could still be holding on to somebody if you were trying to go back to someone else. So you could be holding on to two people. So ain't no point to go back to another person if you already look too many people. OK, um, or this is someone else. Somebody wants to come back towards you in the next seven days here, but they still going to be juggling you anyway. So and I feel like that's going to leave somebody here feeling conflicted and trapped in fear. All right. Um, but I feel like overall, somebody definitely is going to be uh 
in their head in the next seven days here because of a situation where somebody um, was juggling lovers here. Yeah, I feel like somebody's about to be heartbroken here. All right. Um, because somebody was being manipulative and uh, I feel like somebody was being manipulative in the situation here. All right. Um, and now they're scared. Now they're heartbroken because they, they want to come back around, but they still juggling anyway. So what's the point? All right. But anyways, Gemini, that is all for now. Until next time. Later.